Ever wondered why ice cream doesn't freeze into a solid block in your freezer? Well, it's not magic, but science that gives ice cream its unique texture. You see, ice cream is more than just a sweet and frozen dessert. It's a fascinating concoction of dairy, sweeteners, and flavorings combined in a way that results in a creamy, smooth, and yes, soft texture, even when it's frozen. The secret lies in the balance of ingredients that lower the freezing point and prevent the formation of large ice crystals. But how did we get this perfect blend of science and sweetness? Well, it's been a long, cool journey. From its humble beginnings, as a simple mixture of snow and fruit juices, ice cream has evolved, experimented, and innovated its way into our hearts and freezers. It's a tale filled with kings and queens, wars and revolutions, and an endless quest for the perfect. The process of making ice cream is as fascinating as its history. Dive into the world of ice cream production and you'll find a delightful mix of simple ingredients and intricate processes. At the heart of every scoop are three humble components, milk, sugar, and cream. These ingredients form the creamy base of all ice creams, but the magic happens in the transformation process. Freezing and churning are two critical steps in ice cream production. Let's start with the freezing. As the mixture cools, it begins to form tiny ice crystals. If left unchecked, these crystals could turn your creamy dessert into an icy mess. But here's where the second step, churning, comes to the rescue. Churning is essentially stirring the mixture as it freezes. This process serves two vital purposes. It prevents the formation of large ice crystals and it incorporates air. The air whipped into the mix gives ice cream its light, fluffy texture and increases its volume. Without churning, we'd be left with a dense, heavy block of cream. But how did this process scale up to the industrial level? The answer lies in the 20th century invention of the continuous freezer. This ingenious device could freeze and churn the ice cream mixture continuously, allowing for large-scale production. The continuous freezer revolutionized the industry, bringing the joy of ice cream to a mass audience. Ice cream production isn't just a matter of mixing ingredients and freezing them. It's a delicate dance of temperature control, air incorporation, and timing. It's a science, yes, but it's also an art. The balance between the creamy base and the amount of air whipped in can drastically change the final product's texture and taste. The timing of the freezing and churning can affect the size of the ice crystals and ultimately the creaminess of the ice cream. Ice cream production is a perfect blend of science and art, creating a dessert that is universally loved. So what makes ice cream the beloved treat that it is? Well, it's a delightful blend of history, science, and culinary art. From its humble beginnings in ancient China, through the evolution of flavors in Europe to the modern-day factory production, each scoop of ice cream is a testament to centuries of innovation. Ice cream isn't just a sweet indulgence, it's a journey through time and taste. Next time you enjoy a scoop of your favorite flavor, remember the sweet journey it has taken to get to now your let bowl. Let us scoop into the rich history of our favorite frozen treat. Ice cream's sweet journey begins more than a thousand years ago. Picture this. Ancient Chinese emperors savoring a delicate treat of flavored ices, a dessert as fleeting and precious as a snowflake. Meanwhile, Persian nobility enjoyed a similar delight, their version infused with fruits and spices. Fast forward to the Mediterranean, where the concept of ices transcended into a milk-based wonder. It was here that the dessert we're familiar with began to take shape. The Italians, with their innate flair for food, embraced this treat, adding their signature touch. They called it gelato, and it quickly became an integral part of their culture. Across the border, the French were not to be outdone. They took the concept, refined it, and presented it to their royal court. Ice cream became a symbol of luxury, a delicacy to be enjoyed by the elite. It was so coveted that recipes were kept secret, making it all the more enticing. Then, a big leap across the Atlantic, ice cream found its way to the shores of America. Here, it underwent a transformation from an exclusive treat to a dessert for the masses. As the 18th and 19th centuries rolled in, ice cream parlors began to dot the landscape and the sweet treat became a staple of American life. From China to your local ice cream parlor, ice cream has certainly enjoyed a long, sweet journey.